Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. It's been a little while, but we're back. We're finally back. Hope you guys had a great Christmas. I had a pretty good Christmas myself. Gave out a lot of gifts. I felt like I gave more than what I got, which is fine because I wasn't expecting to get so much. And today we've got this beautiful Nissan Titan Warrior concept vehicle. And we're going to be taking it out in a little while. But before we get into that, I've got a lot of stuff to go over. Well, not so much. First things first, quick little update on my car. Uh, I did say the last time that I was going to return the bumper. I'm not. Uh, we found out how to... We found out what the situation was there. Those brackets are actually for the headlight bezels. So I actually ended up buying the bezels and we're gonna, I'm gonna be installing those and I'm gonna be fixing this new bumper that I got. Secondly, there's gonna be a lot of content hopefully coming up. Uh, hopefully I won't be tired as hell. If I do, I'm gonna have to drink some coffee because I was reluctant to even make this episode today. I was just so tired and I'm just, I'm still tired and I don't feel like doing anything else besides this tonight. So uh, I just hope that I'll be able to pull through with that. But I've got Spin Tires, brand new game that I got. I've kind of always been wanting this game and uh, I feel like I'll be able to pull out some great content with that. BeamNG got a great update as well, I've heard. And also we've got, uh, we've got GTA. We've got GTA and we gotta get back into GTA. That's what's, that's what's gotta happen. Um, GTA is just an awesome game that we can play online with mods and I've been slacking I've really been slacking and I know I've said this a lot but I have been slacking a and lot. I think there was something else that I was supposed to announce as well but I forgot so obviously it was not that important as I said this is the Nissan Titan warrior concept I think this is one of the well one of the few times that Forza has actually brought a concept vehicle into Horizon or Motorsport. And to me, this truck is awesome looking. Like it just looks so evil. Like if I imagine this this truck in absolute darkness and all you can see is the lights basically, it would look so menacing like a bear coming out of the woods trying to eat you. Every single feature of this truck, it actually kind of looks like a sportier, tougher stronger raptor that's kind of what this truck looks like this looks like the raptor and maybe the nissan gtr had a baby don't ask me why i said the gtr i associate the greatness of nissan with the gtr i took this truck out of the shop and i was sad to find out that this truck only had 310 horsepower you say 310 horsepower that's a lot for a truck isn't it well this truck weighs 11 tons so this truck did not move. You could actually run faster than it actually took off. So I went and upgraded this truck and we got the final result is about 813 horsepower. And we've got a massive amount of torque. This truck has almost 1500 foot pounds of torque. And we've reduced it to only 9000 pounds. Let's take this baby out and let's see what she can do now. I actually went and upgraded the transmission and a few other things. I was trying to be cheap earlier, but this time I went all out and just upgraded everything. So here we go. Sounds awesome. Sounds like a beast. And I noticed that it's got that uh, tow mode there, which is interesting. I guess it's new technology that they were planning to put. Okay, she definitely moves now. Handles like a boat. But what would you expect out of a car that's 9,000 pounds? And you guys thought the Hellcat was heavy. <laughs> you were wrong. I'll tell you guys that. Holy crap. I feel like I'm flying a boat through this uh, snowy terrain here once that jump fell through. Look at that. We can slide her. Can we get a farther camera view? That's about as far as we get, huh? That's far enough right here. We only rev up to this. Definitely is a diesel, because we can only we can only rev up to 4,500 RPMs, and that's very typical of diesel. So, I'm gonna take a guesstimate and say that this is a turbo diesel. I'm gonna just go flat out and say that because I know my turbo diesels when I hear them. <laughs> Trust me on that one. I just I, I just really love this truck so far. It's it's freaking awesome. I. There's, what's not to love about this truck? I mean, we're just sitting here 
trucking along in our brand new truck. And there's not anything that could make some people happier. I just love the way that the snow looks on certain vehicles, especially this one. It just looks so awesome. I just I was trying to look for a uh, a snow camo for this truck. Because it would have been so awesome having it out here in the snow. And uh, I just didn't find one. So I just went with the Rockstar. This looked pretty pretty good. Rockstar energy drink. We're gonna take it a little off-roading because what's a brand new truck without off-roading, right? Oh, we just hit some rocks. This truck is definitely beastly. I love it. Look at that. We're digging huge tire marks. Holy crap! I did not know that was a cliff. <laughs> I guess we're just going to power on through it. Hit the ice right here. Look at that. This is so fun, actually. Look at that XP. We got to yeah, go back to that XP. You know that. This truck is actually all road drive as well, which, I mean, it has to be, right? It cannot be. Look at that, 20,000 XP. Let's, let's go ahead and hit this wheel spin. See what we get. Hopefully we don't get that many Cooper. That would kind of suck a little bit. Really? 5,000 credits in a row? We've got another wheel spin? All right, let's, let's take it. Let's see what we get this time. Uh, I kind of wanted that Ford Fiesta. I don't know. I kind of wanted it. But I'm not going to get it this time around. I just see if we can hit some jumps. Here's one. Isn't it? Oh, it's a jump. Okay, yeah, we got it. Oh, okay. Yeah, the boat has tipped over. We got to back up. Backing up. Backing up. All right, here we go. Are you guys ready? And I guess we're in a snowstorm. I cannot see anything. Jump! And that wasn't much of a jump. But hey, it was a jump. I cannot see anything. Whether or not I'm going to crash into the Titanic, I do not know. Or maybe we are the Titanic. We're going 70. Okay! I didn't even know that jump was coming up. I guess we made it back around? I don't know. It's hard to tell. It's. There's snow everywhere. I guess we're stuck in a blizzard. This truck is definitely innovative. I really hope Nissan pulled through with this truck because this, I can guarantee this truck would be a very good seller. Very good competition for the Raptor. I don't think that there has been a good enough competition for the Raptor. I do like Ford, but I mean, come on. It's a free market. There's got to be competition for it. The Raptor cannot dominate. If I were to go with a truck, I, even though this truck, even if this truck was out, I still would probably go with a Dodge. But I don't know. If this truck was actually cheap, I would not mind having eventually having it as a daily. Because this truck is just so awesome. It's got everything that you would want in a truck. Very, very strong fortifications. Very good accessories. Turbo diesel, heavy as hell. That just pretty much sums up everything. Gigantic cab, uh, dual cab, gigantic bed so you can fit all your junk in it. I mean, what more do you want from a truck? <laughs> right, here we go. We're climbing. We're in first gear. We're climbing. Come on! Are you kidding me? We can't climb that. Okay, well maybe it is a little too steep. But we gotta try that again. We definitely gotta try that again. Get out of the way, little baby Nissan. Right, here we go. 40 miles per hour up the hill. Oh! Come on! <laughs> it just will not make it, will it? Okay, we gotta. Okay. Let's see. There we are. She's playing in the snow. She's playing in the snow. Okay. Maybe it's too much for this gigantic truck. 
Oh! Watch out, baby Nissan! Watch out! <laughs> Look at all those trails we made up there. It's hard to get a good uh, starting RPM in this track, that's for sure. But can we slide it? That's another question. Can we slide it? See. Oh yeah! Oh yeah, boy! Oh yeah! Oh yeah, I love this truck now. Oh yeah. I don't know, Dodge. I don't know. Okay, what do we got coming up here? What's this? This map is so small, but I still don't know it. Oh! That was a jump, okay. Oh, snap! Our chassis would have been destroyed by now. <laughs> I just love the way this truck sounds still. And it probably would sound a lot better in real life as well. Okay, let's climb this hill here. Redlining. First gear. Oh yeah. She climbs very well. Let's see what other mountains we've got up here. I think we're at the top by now. The top of Blizzard Mountain. Oh. Okay. I definitely saw that coming, but I don't know why I did not avoid it. This truck definitely powers on through just about anything you put it through. I mean, I'm looking at it more and more now, and, and the more I look at it, the more I think, that's a Raptor. <laughs> no, it's not. It's a Nissan. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's like a Titan on a bunch of steroids. Okay, here we go. Can we go up this? Is it going to block us? This is the end of the map here. How far up can we go? Let's see. We shall see. It's starting to get a little heavy. I think it stops us right here. Oh man, this mountain is so slimy. Oh, we got some XP up here. We gotta get this XP. 20k? Let's go. Let's go. Oh! Fail. Anyways, on that note, and some more diesel revving. I'm going to end this episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Like I said, we've got some more content coming up for you guys. I'm going to have this huge explosion that I'm going to be coming out with uh, for the kickoff of 2017. 2016, as you know, was a very trashy year for most people, as seen on the internet. So, we're going to kick off 2017 with a blast. And I hope you guys will enjoy that, and we'll see you in the next video. You can follow up on all my social media and everything. It's all linked in the description for you guys. This is Sinister, and until next time.